All right. Finish up the last little part of that project here. This tree, this limb here on the left needs to get subordinated a little bit so it stops competing. This tree is a removal. So we'll work on that. I need to do kind of some fruit pruning, fruit production pruning on one of those apple trees over there, just so that they can kind of, the homeowners can see <clears throat> what that kind of looks like and then they're gonna copy it. And then there is a small cable going in up front. All right, thank you. All right, we got that subordinated for this year at least. We'll start with that much. Um, this is down. Now we'll go work on an apple tree. And then we got one little cable up front. All right, we got that thinned out and shortened, brought in a little bit. I mean, I took a lot out. That way they can kind of use that as a little bit of an example for these other bushy guys. And uh, go from there. So hopefully that helps them out a little bit with some better airflow. It's not so bushy and tall and Hopefully the fruit is a little bit better quality on it. There we go. It's probably hard to see it with the sun, but put a little cable up in there. Right there. And subordinated that top lead over there a little bit. This tree's already. Got a lot of um, fruit bark and a bad union in there. So that's why we put that cable in to kind of keep the leverage from pulling against that union in there. Probably could use some bracing as well, but we'll start with a cable and go from there. It's not like it's a huge huge tree so I think a cable I think that a cable will work good for now I gotta get that little hanger out but and that is it for this project here to be nice there's a dead or there's a broken branch in that that um, birch over there so I'm gonna grab that real quick and be done Thank you.